Well, hello there. How are you doing today? Wow, today is day three for gratitude and appreciation. And this chapter in the book, The Magic, which is um, written by Rhonda Bryan, The Magic, it's such a great book. Um, this chapter is on relationships. So relationships, what they they want you to um, do is actually pick three, not two, but three relationships that you really um, admire and that you love a lot. And you pick those people and you get their photograph and you write down five things that you're grateful for them. And and then you read it out loud and each each time you look at the picture and you read it out loud and you say, I'm so grateful for this, this, and this. And then you say, thank you three times. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, you know, gratitude will flourish any relationship. It's it's just the, the most important um, point, the most important part, <laughs> most important part of the any kind of relationship is gratitude. So thank you so much for being here today and for checking this out because today it's all about relationships. And, um, you know, it's our, our contact with other people that give our life joy, meaning, and purpose. And the five key essentials for any relationship is trust, respect, love, attention, and guess what? Communication. You know, our ability to communicate determines the quality of the relationships that we have. Which reminds me, I am so grateful for this lady, Rhonda Bren. Um, you can, for her book, I mean, she's like, it's so amazing, the magic. And she's also one of the authors, founders of The Secret. So um, you can get her book on Amazon. It's only $9.79. And just, you know, a little gratitude to her because she's like made all these really cool books, including The Power. So she's done The Secret, The Power, and like she has all these books are so amazing and they're really great because you well, I well I learned so much from them so this is why I'm sharing them with you because I love being able to share what I learn and so for me my three people that I have picked today are um, first of all my daughter my daughter Mercedes rain Mercedes Rain, I am so, so grateful for your smile, for your laughter that you bring to me. I'm so grateful because you inspire me to be the best mom that I can and to be the, my best and my greatest self ever. I'm so grateful for your strength and your confidence that you have. You, you always have courage and I admire that you're so strong and I really love that about you. I love you so much and I can't wait to just give you a big hug. I miss you so much. So that's number one, that's my daughter. And then my second person that I'm so grateful for is my grandma Laurel. So I am so grateful for you, um, grandma, because you are one of my biggest role models that it's ever been in my life, one of my strongest support systems. And you have been by my side and supporting me in everything that I do. And I thank you for investing in your health and never giving up on you. It's so amazing you're 93 years old and you're just so strong and courageous and you're very independent independent you've showed me that you've taught me that over the years and I just I really admire that in you and I just thank you for teaching me that I love you so much and then my third person that I'm so grateful for is one of my really amazing um, mentors uh, that's in my wellness group. His name is Chad Bad Babcock. Chad, I am, I'm so grateful for you. You have taught me so much over the years and, and most important, you have taught me to be grateful. Like, you're the most grateful person that I know, and I just appreciate you so much. I, I appreciate you for never judging me and just loving me for the way I am. I thank you for making me laugh and for just being there to support me in my lead leadership skills, and I thank you for having my back always. You're just such an amazing friend, and I love you so much. I'm just, I'm so grateful for all the um, really amazing people in my life, and, and every day I'm going to come up with three new people, so that's part of the book is that this this uh, chapter is all about relationships and um, and then what you do is you go back to 
uh, the chapter one and two and you bring in 10 things that you're grateful for every day and then you also bring in the magic rock so bring out your magic rock hold on to the magic rock at nighttime and be grateful for the one thing that you were so happy about that day and so and then today is relationships and so I just want to let you know that I love you just the way you are wouldn't that be cool if we could all show up and just love each other for the way we are and not have to have any judgment or criticizing or anything like that so thank you so much for being here I, I want to read you one thing out of um, the power here that I think is so great um, just a little tidbit of this book right here. It's called um, Love Means Freedom. Now that they're, you know, this is a little tricky. And um, it's, it says, giving love in relationships is one more, uh, it's the one thing that has prevented many of us from receiving the love that we deserve. It's tricky because people have misunderstood what it means to give love to others. To be very clear about what it means to give love to others, you need to understand what it means not to give love to others. Try changing another person. Trying to change another person is not giving love. Thinking you know what's best for another person is not giving love. Thinking you have... Um, thinking that you're right and that person is wrong is definitely not giving love. Criticizing, blaming, complaining, nagging, and finding fault with another person is not giving love. So hate is not conquered by hate. Hate is conquered by love because love conquers all. And what we need more anything in the world right now is love and gratitude. And so thank you so much for being here. I'm sending you tons of love, love, lots of love for you. And stay tuned for uh, tomorrow's gratitude um, from the chapter four. So anytime, if you have any gratitude today, go ahead and put them down in the comments there. I'd love to see what you're great, grateful for today. Hope you have an amazing day and we'll talk soon. Shining bright from the inside out. Bye.